All right, ready? Quick. Happy birthday to you. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions unit. This is Corbin. I'm Ricardo. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for Instagram. more juicy content. It's so juicy. Yeah, baby, come get the prisoners. Thank you for listening to us on Patreon. Follow on for your account. Ring the bell with all notifications. Squall. Bye. Today, we are reacting to, I believe, is what I'm told is a devotional song. Uh, it's called uh, Kalinga Nartiana. I don't know. Uh, read the synopsis for me, please, Rick. All right. Uh, Kalinga Nartana Tilana, a famous and vibrant composition of, forgive me if I butcher this, it's a vibrant composition of Uthukadu Sri then Kadakavi. This dramatic composition pictures the Lord Krishna's dance in our mind's eye. This is a challenging composition of the poet with packed lyrics and soikatas that echo the tumultuous movements of the snakes, the surging waves of the sea, and the brisk dance of Krishna. Alrighty. And it's uh, the, the first name that comes on the thing is Vande Guru Param. Param? Yeah, Param Param, I guess so. Uh, do we know that next name? I've, I've think, I've, Say why it? do I feel like we've seen that? Yeah. Surya Gayathri? Oh, it's that young girl. The girl we saw singing. Yeah, the young girl. Yeah, she was singing and she was so composed and she a lot of the time in the video she was with her, her yeah. teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so she's in this. So that's cool. Cool. All right, you ready? Great. Now I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, that's her. Yep. Tum, 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 tum,
gorgeous that was so enjoyable <laughs> oh all three of them <laughs> yeah i mean where do you start i mean the first the first thing was i just loved the blending of the young boy and young girl's voices because a boy his age and a girl her age their voices are in the same range but they are still masculine and feminine mm -hmm. uh it's still boy girl and and it's just a really beautiful compliment to hear those two um, uh, singing the way that they did and their skill level. Mm -hmm. uh, it was interesting. Uh, and, and, it was interesting. Ahead. Once uh, both of them, it was with the opposite hand of the other, but they were both keeping pace with their left hands. Yes. And then yes. they were both doing almost the exact same motions with with this hand. <laughs> yes, but they were. So I'm guessing yeah, that's what they were taught. Still, still the yes. I'm guessing that's like a something that's they're taught to do to keep pace with uh, how the, what they're what they're supposed to be in the song. But it was it was really impressive. I'm guessing that's their guru uh, with mm -hmm. them, their teacher, right? Uh, My guess too. Yeah. But he was also <laughs> at the beginning. He was doing the thing that was. I think there was a tabla playing at the exact same time, but they were doing the exact same notes on yeah. top of each other <laughs> yeah yeah two two things about this the fir first one um, uh, aside from what i just said was um there's so many fun things rhythmically that they did that we've heard in similar kinds of music where with their uh, vocalizations it's so similar to what tap dancers do with their feet mm -hmm. in syncopation and and different feelings to the rhythm um it's just it, it, they're tap dancing with their mouths but they're just it's a little more complicated because they're also having to add to it tonality and mm -hmm. actual words but the syncopation and the rhythms are as complicated as ex extremely uh, experienced tap dancing and i so caught the visuals they wanted with the snake and the dancing and even at the end you could feel the transitions and the pacing it was going and then it went da 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 -da. It just started to stutter and kind of cascade, almost like a rock falling down a hill. When it gets down to the bottom, it does a couple of final lasts. The trajectory is ending, and it's coming to a, a stop. Mm -hmm. um, just a journey. Again, like so much of the Indian music we've listened to, yeah, it takes you on a journey. All of them are so, so talented. That was like just a, a fast 10-minute jam session. That it was like you were just listening to these people just have fun. And, and and do what they do and that was just so so enjoyable we loved that and um so i'm guessing that's uh, also in a devotional song is i believe what they said so like the song they were singing was like a a big devotional uh song for a lot of yeah. people i think um but i can see why because you could get in a trance listen to like but like almost like a happy you really trance. could 
Yeah, and the other thing mood. too, the other thing too is it it also goes to show you that you don't always need to have. I mean, you and I love visual artistry and cinematography and lighting and set, and that all can play a massive part. But this was just the three other faces most of the time. Yep. Yep. And I was I was entranced. I was just locked on yeah, it. That was so so fun. Let us know really, what else really of these nice. people that we should watch next. Any other singers like that? Let us know down below.